A grain of sand can measure it, and it can fly with our wings. What am I talking about, anyone? Time! Is it me, or is Miss Lacey even more spacey than usual? <laughs> huh? Sadie? <laughs> so near, and yet so painfully far. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, what's going on? The acapella club is selling tickets for their concert tonight. So? They're singing theme songs from the great Zorflux invasion and Planet Bubonic. <coughs> Loser. And they have Olympia as their special guest. <laughs> as in the movie star Olympia? What? She's Nolan's half-sister. I'm so going to that concert. Me too! You like Planet Bubonic? <sighs> Time is a mystery, but it rules us. Oh, time is mean is what time is. Come on, Belle, just bring already. Hmm, there's a best frenemies marathon on TV. Gilbert wouldn't notice if time sped up just a teensy eensy bit. Tick tock tick, let's make you quick. Jerry, it must be true. I heard it directly from Hugo's mother's uncle's daughter's wife. <laughs> And these days, metronomes are electronic, but... Oh, look at that! Time really does fly! Move! Ugh, get out of my way! Okay. Well, don't forget, your reports on the measurement of time are due Friday! Come on, Come on Lulu! Time waits for no one! <laughs> <laughs> I've got a hundred ideas for our report. Wait! A hundred and one! Sadie, can we work at your place tonight? Are you kidding? We have the gig of a lifetime to go to! But come on, Lulu, we've got loads of time. And look how happy TP is. Manic, bubonic, and I will clone your brain! <laughs> You're right. No one can resist that much enthusiasm. Yes! Yes! Woodwork! What's it all about? It's about testing your limits. Right, I need a volunteer. TP! Ah! Phew! Saved by the bell. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Just in time. Please take out your biology books. Everybody done their exercises? <laughs> TP, why don't you come up and do number 14 on the board? <laughs> hey, I love this bell. Huh? Metal, what's it all about? It's about me winning this gold cup! <laughs> huh? Who cares? It's lunchtime! That was weird. Like, I blinked and class was over. It's the best Tuesday ever. Super quick morning and now, lunch. And the dream is over. Sadie, you wouldn't know anything about this, would you? Me? <laughs> no! Uh, oh my gosh, I think I left the concert tickets in the lab. TP, you want to help me find them? Uh, how? Hmm. Oh no, not good. You are going uh -huh. to be in so much trouble. Shh, Cornelius. We can fix this easy. Yeah. How exactly? Ah, perfect. Ah, duct tape, the all-purpose solution. You hope so. <sighs> Everything will soon be back to normal. Ah, with a whole <laughs> afternoon of classes till the concert. Unless... Not a good idea, TP. You're right, it's not. It's a great idea. Come on, Sadie, wind that clock forward. Whoa. Come on, you know you want to. Mm. Okay, fine. Yes! Uh, Cornelius, it's been a pleasure as always, but right now we have a date with a movie star. Hey! <laughs> I haven't a sense of a sponge. I heard it directly from Hugo's mother's uncle's gardener's wife. <laughs> Jerry, how could you? Uh, how is it nearly six? Ready for the greatest concert ever? But how did... Less talking, more walking. The doors will open in six minutes. Yes! Ten seconds. Nine, eight, seven. Shocker. Four, three. That's weird. My watch is saying it's 11 a.m. and it's... Thursday. So the concert is over? Oh, no. No! Can't be happening! I know! Our report is due <gasps> tomorrow! Don't worry, guys. I can fix this. I just need uh, a hot glue gun, maybe some staples. Back to class! But it's nighttime. That clock says it's morning, and I don't get paid if you don't get taught, so move it! Aww, dude. <gasps> Jerry's got a twin brother! Uh oh. <laughs> Sadie Josephine Sparks? What did you do? Using her middle name. That's not good. Okay, uh, so don't get mad. But I may have put a teensy-weensy spell on the class clock. You put, put a, a spell, spell on time? time? 
I said don't get mad! Everyone outside, now! Hey, it's Tuesday again! Thursday... Tuesday! Oh. Thursday... Tuesday! Okay, that's something. The spell only affected time inside Harmony High. <gasps> so maybe we could write the report outside and then pass it to Miss Lacey through the window. Lulu, stop worrying about the report. Lucky for you, there's a counter spell. <laughs> Problem solved. Not so fast. You'll have to work together, or rather sing. Who's dead? In a round. A perfectly timed, fiendishly difficult tongue twister of a round. Oh. Oh. What class are we about to be in? Coach, we've only just started drama. Oh, can we go? The bell is the bell. Now out! Should we leave? Yes. No! Yes. <laughs> Having a good time, Sadie. Come on, Gilbert. <laughs> No, 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 no! I told you! If the timing isn't right, the spell won't work! Ugh. You're too fast, you're too slow, and TP. What's with the beatboxing? I thought it added a certain... Lose it! Please, for the love of rabbits, no more improvisation! Just <sighs> follow my ruler and try to stay in time, OK? Then let's do this. Ready? And... Tick-tock, tick-tick-tick-tock. We'll fix time and make it stay. tick tick So, is that like a standing ovation? I don't understand. I knew it. Terrible timing, awful pitch. You've made things worse. Oz, hang on. It was your idea to uh, follow that bunny. Huh? What the heck? Huh? <gasps> oh no. Come on, Dave. Come on, Max. Oh, I'm beat. I need a break. <gasps> Come on, guys. Breakfast? Dinner? This is like warping my mind, man. Morning, Trixie. Evening, Tammy. Morning. Evening. Morning. Evening. <gasps> Look, the town hall clock's going crazy. Uh... This! Is why you don't mess with time, Sadie. 26 p.m.? That can't be good. Mine says minus 3 a.m. <sighs> I think that's nearly tomorrow. What if we're stuck in eternal darkness? Ooh, maybe we'll develop night vision. Maybe we could try the spell again on another clock. What other clock? Oh. They're all beyond repair. We never even started the report. We had ages, and now... We could repair it. No, Sadie, you can't just repair... Guys. <laughs> ...a magically broken clock. <laughs> Guys, but we must be able to... What about the report? Nobody make any sudden moves. Lulu, you okay? I had so many great ideas, but it was all, not yet, Lulu, wait till later, Lulu, and now there's no time left because we broke it! We broke time! I saw this on Zork Master. It's always the ones you least expect to blow first. TP! Lulu, you really care about that report, don't you? Mm. What gave it away? I'm sorry. Hey, how about we work on it now? Really? Really? It's important to Lulu, and she's our friend. Also, since time is all over the place anyway, does it really matter? Yes! <laughs> Good point. Well made. <laughs> One, two, three. The report on the measurement of time is done. Phew. Wait, isn't there a sundial in the town square? And it's not mechanical, so it can't break. Come on. There's a what? Nowhere. Sorry, TP. <sighs> okay, you have to get the timing and words absolutely perfect. Oh, and the tune. Honestly, I don't know. Seriously? That's your motivational speech? Okay, step aside, rabbit. My turn. Lulu, you may be tone deaf, and Sadie, you may have the timing of a caffeinated monkey bashing a pot lid with a spoon. TP! Rocking it so far, TP. But you are the best friends a guy could have. And if I had to do this with anyone, I would choose you. Thanks, TP. Tick tock, tickety tock, fix up the mix up box, 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 the m
Maybe you're late too, kids. I don't know where the week has gone. Thank gosh, it's Friday. Ah, I wouldn't fast forward one second. I didn't know A++ even existed. And you know what I'm gonna do to celebrate? Absolutely nothing. Me too. I like your plan. Hmm. Anyone else bored? Yep. Yeah. Little bit. 